Aaron Bach was the man who made Tina Tena know what real love is. But Tina rejected Aaron several times for 23 years before finally accepting to marry him. After Tina Tena suffered an abusive marriage with her first husband, Ike Tena, she was left traumatized, which led to her disinterest in marriage and relationships. She described her marriage to Ike Tena as physically and emotionally abusive, and says which felt like rape. After enduring the beatings and emotional abuse for years, Tina finally left the marriage with Ike Tena. In 1985, which was seven years she finalized her divorce from abusive husband Ike Tena, Tina met German music producer Aaron Bach. Aaron's love for Tina was love at first sight and didn't let her go from the moment he set his eyes on her. However, Tina wasn't ready for another marriage. Aaron proposed soon after they met, but Tina rejected his proposal. When she was about 49 to 50 years old, Aaron proposed for the second time, but once again Tina rejected him for the second time. Even though Tina was already living with Aaron in France, but she was never ready for another marriage. In 1995, when Aaron Bach was asked to manage a company in Switzerland, Tina said she immediately followed Erin to Switzerland. This was where things changed in their love life. After living with Erin for several more years in Switzerland, Erin proposed again in 2012, and this time, Tina gave an emotional yes to Erin's proposal. According to Tina Tena, it was a commitment that didn't come easily to her, but she knew he was the love of her life. Tina and Erin finally got married in 2013, a year after Tina accepted his proposal. Within that same year they got married, Tina suffered from a stroke and Erin took care of her. Tina also suffered from chronic kidney disease and its complications. Once again, Erin showed love to Tina by donating one of his kidneys to her. Tina described her relationship with Erin Bach as really good because he really loved her. Thanks for watching.